So Kaiji Inafune's company, Cons Comcept, excuse me, Comcept, um, has been struggling. Um, it was founded in 2010. The only thing that they've really released to their name is Mighty Number no. Nine. Um, not to many people's satisfaction. Um, they're still working on games such as Red Ash and Kyo, King of Pirates, um, which also are not doing too well in the their development cycles. But it appears that Level 5 has purchased Comcept. Level 5, of course, they're famous for uh, Nino Kuni. They made Dragon Quest VIII. Yeah, these are those... That's... That's who these guys are. They made the Dark Cloud games back in the PS2 era. Um, they're a good company. They're pretty. They're pretty fairly decent. Oh yeah, Nino Cooney was amazing. Yeah. So they kind of know what they're doing, I would say. So now that they purchased Comcept, um, I don't expect to see you know Kickstarters asked for every single game that they want to make, and they'll actually have to make a good game. And not hire, you know, whatever marketing department came up with that stupid trailer for Mighty Number no. 9, you're not going to see that from them anymore either. So, all in all, I think this is very good news for Comcept. Personally, I like Kaiji Inafune. He's not the inventor or creator of Mega Man, but he did bring the series to a point where everyone loved it. I think he's got some good ideas. I just don't think he knows how to run a game company. I think he's a developer, not a CEO or whatever his role was in Comcept. I certainly hope it wasn't coming up with the name Comcept because that's the most irritating thing to try and say because my brain keeps wanting to say concept. Concept, right. <laughs> so, yeah... They should have just called it, like, Level 5 something else, not Level 5 Concept. <laughs> Plus, you know, level, having, starting something with the word level and having a number next to it, I mean, that's, you can't go wrong. Studies have shown that. that you'll do okay. Please comment, like, and subscribe. <laughs> 